Cao Cao's ambition had been swallowed in a sea of crimson flame. However, he would not abandon his quest. Not until he seized the land that he had fought so long and hard for. Several days after the Battle of Cherbi, he returned to Xu Zhang. Thrust! Sweep! And again! Remember the shame of Cherbi! Never again! Is that it? Is that all you lot have? Oh, it's a demon! Lord Liu Bei, save us! Someday soon, your head will be mine. My lord. Wake up! I was dreaming. I thought you were depressed by Chur B. But I see you're relaxed enough to nap. There is no point in crying now. Now is a time for rest. For eating, sleeping, and training. For our next battle. <laughs> Cao Cao, Sun Quan, Liu Bei. Following the Battle of Chirbi, these three men became the center of everything. Cao Ren, charged with the defense of Jiangling, performed admirably against the combined onslaught of Sun Quan and Liu Bei. Even though the city eventually fell to Zhou Yu, he was able to hold out for more than a year. Afterward, Cao Cao again began plotting a campaign to invade the South and sent for Ma Tung. Ma Tung was one of the men involved in the previous attempt to assassinate Cao Cao. Cao Cao was determined to eliminate this possible threat before making his move south. However, his actions would lead to trouble in the west. With his father killed, Ma Tung's son, Ma Chao, gathered an army together with Han Sui and rose up against Cao Cao. Cao Cao was forced to postpone his southern campaign and instead sent his troops to Guangzhou. He was more than prepared to face his new adversary, a man consumed by the desire for revenge. The strategies of his master tactician at the ready, they came head to head at Tong Gate. I suppose it is from fatigue, but Lord Cao Cao seems to have lost his edge. Really? Well, isn't it the job of a strategist to cover for that? Hmm. It is hard for even me when he does too much. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> you seem tired, my lord. Joshu, tell me, what strategy have you devised for us? We will strike them head on. Oh, the enemy is filled with people from Guangzhou. Until recently, they were all mortal enemies of each other. You mean to destroy them from within? Precisely. I have heard that you and the enemy general Han Sui are old acquaintances. So, you are in need of my assistance for your plan. Excellent, Lord Cao Cao. Now, if you will. Welcome! Time is nearly upon us. Let us make our move. Understood. I am putting you in charge of my forces for this battle. Don't let me down, Joshua. You wish me to command your army? Very well. Our first step must be to blunt the momentum of their mounted troops. We must claim strategic points on the front line. Fight me now, for glory! But the old sons never had given the strategy to full control.
time for you to move forward, my lord. If you could make for Han Sui's position. Han Sui! Ah, I see you to sow the seeds of distrust in the enemy ranks. Careful how you use our lord's strategy. Use me if you want to pawn. See how you work. All he needs to do is make contact with this way. If the rest of them see that, they'll get suspicious. Lord Cao Cao, you may retreat to safety now. Leave the rest to me. You have no place left to go. You... You set me up. You were the one who sent Sao Cao to me. Perhaps I did. But the fact is, your only choices are to join me now, or die. So you are my next opponent. I'll crush you like all of the others. Stop me if you can. I shall return. Remember that. For yours is the first head I shall seek. There is not a strategist alive that can best me in that. Now that's how it's done. You inspire us all. Dai is charging forth from the enemy ranks toward us. He wishes to eliminate Lord Cao Cao directly. He must be stopped at once.
I must retreat. I suppose I wasn't ready to face this particular trial. to meet you. until the proper moment presents itself. to assist us? Fight me now! For glory! must rouse ourselves for this battle. Now that's how it's done. You inspire us all. Stop. I am sorry for the inconvenience. Thank you for your assistance.
go no further. I shall stop you here. Stop me if you Hang can. Hang in there. Victory is almost ours. We must retreat. This is not the end. There is not a strategist alive that can best me in battle. I shall return. Remember that. For yours is the first head I shall see. Wan Jong now belongs to you. Where will you go from here, my lord? The future is unknown. Really? I thought you were a man of vision. I am. I simply realize that things do not always go as planned. Including the fates of Liu Bei, of Sun Quan, and indeed, my own. I think you're right. Our lord does seem a little tired. 